Hi you guys. Okay, so this setup is completely different than it usually is. Don't mind my hair. I don't really know what's going on. I am here with Maverick and we're here to do his five month update. And I don't know if I like should close the window or leave it open. Right now, it might be distracting, but I'm just gonna leave it open for now. Um, but yeah, we're here to do his five month update and I'm like seriously in the middle of cleaning, trying to fix my washer and trying to get my toddler to sleep. So I think he's sleeping and I'm like, okay, real quick, let me do his five month update because soon, oh my gosh, I can't stand my hair. It's probably super annoying to you guys. Um, he'll be six months in two weeks. So I wanna get this video done because I don't want to skip his months, huh? So we need to do my five month update, mommy. He's got a little boogeries going on right now. He's a little stuffy. Okay, so I don't have like his updated weight and height and everything, but the last time he was weighed, he was 15 pounds and like 15 ounces, 15 pounds. Let me look right here. He was over 15 pounds and his head was 42 and a quarter, 27 and three fourths inches long. So, um, they didn't, oh my god, you guys, I am not gonna be able to handle this. Okay, that's a little better. I just couldn't handle the hair. I, it's like a mess right now. That is like the updated weight and height that I have for him. For him, this has been a crazy month with him. So much is just happening with him. He, his personality is seriously the best. He's the sweetest baby ever. And he did have his first ever sickness, which was a lot more sick than like Paxson ever got. He had 101 fever, he was miserable, Paxson had like a 24 hour bug and then he got it like right afterwards. He, They weren't like throwing up or anything but they had a fever and I think also it was him teething. He didn't feel well, I don't think he had the flu but I think he had like a little virus. For Paxson it was like 24 hours, for him it was like 2 days. He was crying all night long he rarely cries so to hear him crying like that i've never heard either of my boys cry like that he was so upset i think he was just overtired teething not feeling well all the above like he was not happy um but thankfully when he started feeling better he was back to his happy smiley self which made me so happy because i was nervous like for a second should i take him to the hospital i don't know i know he's over like the three months but he's only at that time five months old like i don't know i was scared i gave him a bath like a warm bath and everything and that seemed to really help and then just cuddled him on the couch he has also has said his first word which was dada um shocker but he said that probably it was the oh i'm sorry he said that the day that he turned five months and rob said he heard it like the week before so right before he turned five months he said his first word and i didn't hear him until he turned exactly five months that day he said it and he has said it a few other times since then but oh my gosh it's the cutest thing ever so he said dada he got his first tooth you guys are not going to be able to really see it and yeah you're not <laughs> it's like not totally through but it's like breaking the skin now so he's getting his like first tooth and that makes sense with all the um what's it called drool and all that and he seems to be a good teether like paxton paxton with teething was really super easy he seems to be um affected by it a little bit more but not like you know unconsolable like crying or anything like that but how cute is his outfit rob's sister got it for him and he's just so cute he's getting so much hair he is sitting up for a few seconds at a time unassisted i'll put the boppy behind him to help but he's doing really well with sitting up and um what else is he doing he's trying to crawl so much like i had a clip in my one vlog with him in just his diaper like trying to crawl on the mattress he's like getting his hiney up and just pushing himself forward it's so cute um his favorite toy um i want to say is he really likes his walker he loves the bouncer all that stuff he loves um but for other things he still loves his little giraffe binky he loves his new sophie that he got for christmas what other things does he like oh and he really seems to like cars and trucks and stuff he'll try to get packs in it's really cute he's in nine month clothing right now his christmas outfit was 12 months it was definitely a little big but it didn't look that huge on him. But definitely nine months is the clothing he's wearing. For diapers, he's in size three. But since Paxton's potty train now, we have like a bunch of fours and we have been putting them on him because we don't want to waste them because they were already open. So we're like, all right, you're gonna wear fours until that pack is done and then he'll go back to three. Um, but he's definitely more of a size three in his diapers. If he wants to go somewhere, he will just roll 
to where he needs to go and he can like roll and like turn his body in like the different directions which is really cute um he loves to be cuddled we're still like coat <laughs> We're still co-sleeping. I plan on co-sleeping with him until he's about seven months, but that's crazy. It seems like so close, like so soon that he'll be seven months. And I'm like, I'm not ready for him to go in his crib, but I know it'll be good for him and it'll be better in the long run for his sleeping habits and all that. So I think he'll do fine. He only wakes up about once a night now. I want to say, yeah, like once a night he wakes up to nurse. Um, recently he's been waking up a little bit more just of him being stuffy and stuff but mainly he's been just waking up once a night and he takes about a two to three hour nap during the day um, at like 10 30 11 o'clock and then depending because sometimes we like depending what we're doing if we're going out then it, the time will change or whatever but usually it's between like 10 30 11 o'clock that he takes his long nap sometimes he'll take a nap at 8 30 like a quick nap and then he'll usually take a nap at like three o'clock he'll take another probably like hour nap he's still taking his binky he doesn't take it as much now um and i'm gonna do the same thing with the binky as i did with paxton i took the binky away at like 11 months with paxton i'll probably do the same because it just worked out well with habit wise and all that Paxton didn't seem to care at all that he didn't have the binky after that. His hair is like light brown color. If you guys, you guys probably tell. It's like a light brown color. It's super pretty. He looks so cute with all his hair coming in. He loves tummy time. He loves being on his belly. He loves just rolling around everywhere. He loves his brother. And he's really like, I feel like he's a true mama's boy. He loves being with me and just smiling at us and everything. He is super easy to take anywhere. Like you can just take him anywhere and he's happy. He loves Ergo and all that. And we're gonna start solids when he turns six months, same as we do with Paxton. I feel like I'm doing a lot of this stuff the same as with Paxton, just because it works so well with Pax that why not just do it the same? And I, you know, I feel comfortable with it. He's doing great with breastfeeding. He still really, 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 really favors the left side. Uh, I blame it partly on me too with him not nursing too much on the right side. I'm trying to be better lately. I would like my boobs to be like somewhat of the same size. It's so noticeable, especially like in the summer, it's gonna be like, wow girl, your boobs are two way different sizes. Um, so I'm hoping, do we look alike you guys? <laughs> but anyways, I'm hoping that uh, I can get him to like the right side. He is not very good with a bottle. I tried to give him a bottle uh, when he was sick of milk that was like colostrum from when I just had him when he was sick to make him, you know, because that milk is so good for them, but he wanted nothing to do with it. I don't know if it was because he didn't want the bottle or he didn't like the taste of the milk, but he is not very good with taking bottles. I want him, well, my hair, I want him to get better with that just in case like me and Rob want to go on a date, then I, you know, don't have to bring him. And I don't have to like rush home to nurse him. He loves to nurse, but he's not a big comfort nurser like Paxton was. Paxton was a huge nur comfort nurser. He's not. He really just nurses to eat. Well, comfort nurse a little bit at night, but not like Paxton did. He's fine in the car. Now he doesn't mind the car seat. We will be, um, he, we do have a Brightex advocate for him already that we got for Paxton just to use when he was with Rob's mom. So it's only been used not that much it's like basically it looks brand new and we got that knowing that um maverick would be using it so we have that already for him i'll probably transition him to that once he hits like six months because he's just getting way too heavy to carry in the infant car seat he had his first christmas he was adorable he was really cute like looking at everything that he got and what paxton got and i think he really liked watching like paxton's reaction are you getting tired now he's getting nap time I think that was all for the update. I gotta get back to cleaning and I just wanted to sit down with you guys. This is probably gonna be my new like um, recording area. I do plan on like eventually painting my room probably in like February. I wanna paint my whole room. We're in the process of redoing it like slowly. Um, we don't put anything on credit card so it just takes some time. But we're, yeah, we're doing things slowly. I'm planning this week to get my new dresser, which I'm excited about. Um, and then I want to get like side tables. But this room will be painted probably like February. And then I want to get like 
cute curtains. One behind me, obviously, and then one on this window. That way it doesn't look like this in the background. But it's just so much easier because my lights are in my room instead of bringing my lights into Maverick's room. And especially because Maverick will be in his room taking naps and sleeping and stuff. That way I'm not going to be able to record in there um, when they go to bed. But this will be my new recording area. Hope you guys don't mind. But thank you guys so much for watching this update. I can't believe this little boy is... Like gonna be six months old in two weeks. I just can't believe it. You just do cute. You want to put a new cheek? All right, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. We're done, buddy. You did good job. You had me. This is your good boy, huh? Oh. Cause where you go is where I go. I don't need nobody else. I got you. Let's go. And you got me too. I wanna do what you want to We can leave and run away